guys, what's up? What's up guys? So, 
Great. All right. Yes. There we go. Couple of yes. One yes right now. How about others? All right. Yeah. Up, 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 up. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let me do some magic there. Uh, all right. So let's just start. All right. This is going to be a little different this time. Okay. That, that's my birthday hat. So I, I hope you don't mind wearing me that. That's a pretty cool stuff. Huh? Barbecue Nation. I'm promoting it. So how I got started in digital marketing and how you could also get started. Okay. Miss the question? The question is then the, the, it's the scope about me, how I got started and how you can also get started. Okay, so guys, today I met one of my uh, students as well. His name is Paul Kett, and we were discussing about one simple thing. Uh, I hope, you know, everybody is able to get a, let me just, you know, bring it close, this, this particular periscope, so that you have proper volume. Last time I saw that there was some volume issues. Oh, let me see if I could make it more closer. All right, let's just go ahead. So, uh, all right, this is not looking cool. This is not looking cool. All right. So this is me, you know, uh, how I got started in digital marketing. So let me just, you know, take you back to the days, old days of 2010. So we were back in 2010, and in 2010, me and Saurabh, Saurabh is my business partner. So what we were doing is we were actually involved in a network marketing company. Uh, I don't even remember the name of the company now, but what we were doing is we were trying to sell websites. So the model was network marketing, something which MV, MV, MV follows, okay. But uh, at the same time, what we were trying to do is we were trying to sell websites to a lot of people. So we sold it to approximately 400 people, okay, website and hosting. So it was website plus hosting. And at that point in time, uh, we used to sell the, you know, website plus hosting by saying, hey, you know, it's, it's pretty cool. You also get a custom uh, email ID. And, you know, whenever you go out to a particular meeting, you could just say, hey, it's, it's my email ID is not xyz at the rate gmail.com. It's professional. It's, it's xyz at the rate uh, xyz.com or whatever your name is. Like, for example, my email ID is gm at the rate garamadan.com. All right. So that's, that's uh, how it all started. And then uh, at the time when we were just, you know, selling those websites, what happened, what tend to happen is we happened to make one for ourselves as well. All right. We, I made one for me, so I still remember the number one website which I made was gaurabuzz.info in 2010, back in 2010, okay? Uh, then the dot-com bubble wasn't even there. So, uh, but in 2010, made gaurabuzz.info, so, uh, you know, what happened, there was, a, there was a roommate I had. He was a national badminton player, okay? So, his name was Azad, and he used to chat on a, you know, adult-based website. It's not an adult-based website, it, it was a chatting website, sex chatting website, I don't know. Okay, so there was a particular uh, website he used to chat up with. So I'll slow down, I'll slow down, no worries. So there was a website, uh, you know, which he, he used to actually chat upon. So what I said, uh, you know, let's explore this website. At that time, I, I got something called as Google AdSense, okay. There was something called as Google AdSense. So I, I got approved for Google AdSense program through which we could show ads on our website and earn money. So what I did, I did a very smart strategy at that point in time wherein, so I, I put and put up an, a page, I set up a page wherein there was an advertisement and on top it used to say, hey, click here to watch uh, the webcam, live webcam of, uh, you know, a girl. So I used to just put up a name of the girl. Okay, no photo, nothing, just an ad, just the name of the girl and, you know, we used to say, I used to say, just click here to... You know, watch a webcam of the girl. So, and then what I did after uh, publishing that page, uh, I took the URL and then I went to that chatting website, whatever that website was. I don't even remember the name of the website. Uh, I don't remember the name of the website right now. It's long, long ago. So, I went there and after, like, you know, there was an option to say new chat. I always used to do new chat and then, you know, copy paste that particular message. Hey, do you want me to go live on a webcam? Blah, blah, blah. And I, you know, just click go there and follow the instructions on this URL. And, you know, I, I did that for two long hours. Okay, two long hours. I, at that point in time, I was around how much? So I was 18 years old. Very young. Not 18, sorry. I was 20 years old. Okay, today I'm 25. So uh, at that point in time, I was 20. So I used to do that. And then what happened? Within two hours, I was able to get 200, sorry, $100. I was able to earn within two hours $100 from, uh, you know, Google AdSense. And that is the time I realized, hey, man, this has got something, you know, 
really powerful. Like this is really, really amazing stuff. Okay. So, uh, you know, that's how I got started actually. And I realized that there's a lot of power in internet marketing. That we could go right, like really a crazy uh, amount of things. So now at that point in time, I was building, doing my graduation. Okay, my graduation in BSc Electronics Honors. I was doing an electronics course and I was into robotics. Okay, so I, I have built my own robot using sensors and hardware programming. Okay, so there's a video as well on my YouTube channel of a, of a robot which I built. Okay, it was a line following robot I made. So at that point in time, I, I got involved in that and, you know, uh, left this for a little while. But then I realized, you know, it was final year of my graduation and I thought, hey, let's just, you know, let's learn this particular art. So what I did, uh, I did a mistake at that point in time and I went to do my MBA and thinking that the MBA in 2012 in India would teach me about digital marketing. Okay. So that was a mistake I did, uh, definitely, but, you know, that wasn't just a mistake. It, it turned out into a, uh, you know, good thing for me as well because I met my mentor in, in uh, you know, in my, in my MB college. So I met my mentor and through him, so what happened, so my mentor was a real estate uh, marketing guy. He was a head of real estate, okay, uh, mark for marketing marketing company in Hyderabad, a big marketing company. And so he used to do a lot he used to do a lot of, uh, you know, workshops. So, yeah, great times indeed they were. Okay, so, hey, AGM Clothing, what's up? So, what happened, we, we actually, uh, you know, he used to do a lot of workshops and he gave me an opportunity to do a workshop in Pune. So, Pune is another part of India for people who are outside India. So, it's, it's a city in India. So, where I got an opportunity to do a workshop with 50 entrepreneurs, okay, and that was the uh, task. Obviously, I knew a lot about digital marketing beforehand, but not a lot, okay? So what I did, after that, uh, we went there, went to Pune, did a workshop, and in that eight-hour workshop, I was a speaker, uh, and I had to speak almost uh, three hours, right? So that is where I got all, it all got started from that particular point in time. On that workshop, I, I actually got three consulting leads, three consulting leads right there, okay, in that workshop. So workshops are great fun. You could get a lot of leads, trust me, okay? Uh, because of the networking time, if you can pitch right, you could actually get a lot of, uh, you know, value, a lot of leads. So that's where I got my first three consulting leads. And, you know, I was trying to browse, uh, you know, the, la the first check I got. So I got around like $500 was my first check at that point in time. Uh, that's how I got started in 2013. This was, or I get, I guess it's early 2014. I'm not sure about that. It was either 2013 or early 2014. And that's where, we, uh, like, you know, I started doing uh, advertisement and started learning more of it. Started executing these particular consulting projects. So what happened? I learned the entire art of consulting. So I had the opportunity of learning consulting from my mentor, which was Mr. Vinod Achanta. Okay, so that's what I'm doing right now. So I've, I've also done the same thing. So I've made this course, which is Internet Profits, okay, and uh, this is going to go live soon. And in this course, I've done the same thing. I've blueprinted that entire art, okay, and I'm teaching other people the same thing which I learned from there. So now what happened after learning that thing, what I did, it's not about learning. You learn a lot of things. You have a lot of things in you already. Okay, then what I did was I went to local market. So my, my particular key was to go to local market and not... Uh, you know, roam around uh, on internet to actually, uh, you know, start making money. So what I did, I went to these uh, local market and when I went there, so what I possibly did, there were a lot of people, a lot of businesses in offline space which are still not online, one, or even if they are online, they are not effectively online, okay? So all I had to do is I had to crack a meeting with them and once I've cracked the meeting, I had to go there after going there, you know, uh, pitch my PPT and tell them how this could benefit them, how having a website could actually benefit them. And not just having a website, but a proper functional working website where they could generate a lot of leads would be really, really cool for them. That's what I did. All right. After that, you know, after doing that for a couple of times, I really got to know about how it is all done. And I connected all the dots and I started making websites for local businesses and you know how much I used to charge them 
can you even guess how much I used to charge them? Anybody? Can anybody uh, guess how much I used to charge these local businesses? About uh, you know how how much possibly uh, anybody who could make a guess? It it would be like amazing just for making a website. I used to charge quite a lot of money. Okay, so I used to charge uh, approximately. 50k no uh, no idea so it was approximately so i used to do uh, not 30000 i used to charge 1 lakh rupees okay that's up. so you know how much is 1 lakh rupees so 1 lakh rupees is uh, 1500 dollars 1500 dollars in us currency if you know that okay so i used to charge 1500 dollars for making website so now since i already knew uh, how much is that okay uh, 1500 dollars and since I knew how to make a website, so I used to make a website within two days. And that to investing only six to 12 hours of my time, I used to make the entire website. That's all. Okay, that's I, that's what I used to do. Okay, guys, imagine two, or two days of work, $1,500 in your pocket. All right. And then that is which, which actually gave me the first initial flow. Nobody knows about this. So even now, if you just know how to do Facebook advertisement, or if you just know plainly how to, you know, uh, do make a website in WordPress, there are still a lot of local businesses which are there, which you could go ahead and you know you could make a website for, and you could get started just like that. And if you know don't have the confidence to do so, okay, this course is coming for you. Okay, this course is coming for you to give you all the knowledge, all the proposals, which proposals, how to do it very, very effectively. Everything is going to come up. So, so, you know, even uh, I have a student here, Raj. So, Raj is one of my students. So, Raj could testify for that statement. So, Raj, what do you think? So, have you started doing these things already? So, Raj, can you can you testify it? You know, what do you think? So, are you able to make this uh, strategy work right now? So, if Raj is there, I'm pretty sure. So, all right. So, I'm also one. So, Raghav is another one. Absolutely amazing. So, I've got two people right now. Uh, who could testify this? So uh, one one of my uh, buddies, Aditya Gorle. Okay. So Aditya Gorle. Another is Saurabh Hatnagar. Another is uh, Raj. Another is uh, Raghav. So you know they 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 are doing somewhere around six lakh rupees now per month. Now six lakh rupees per month. Can you imagine six lakh rupees? How much is six lakh rupees? Okay. We were building websites on nothing, but we were doing it on simply WordPress. Okay. So simply WordPress. So, uh, and you know, right now, one of my students is doing 6 lakh rupees per month. 6 lakh rupees translates into, it's into INR, 6 lakh, okay, and uh, if, I, I, if I translate 6 lakh into dollars, that would be somewhere around 1500 into 6. So, 1500 into 6, uh, I guess, it would be somewhere around $9,000. $9,000 a month, okay, that would just simply by making websites. So, he do 6 websites, all right. So, uh, six websites, amazing stuff. So, you mean, you mean more information about the course? That's going to come. Uh, so, approximately, it's approximately $10,000. So, that's what it is. Thank you so much uh, So for that. Okay, it's true. Uh, you know, you should miss out on internet profits. So, that, thank you so much for your art. So, guys, that's what I did. And, you know, that is pretty cool. So, it's all, it's nothing. You know, it's pretty same, pretty, it's pretty plain, which is uh, about... You know, making websites for the offline businesses who are not yet online and helping them to give them an identity and just giving, doing it professionally gives you the leverage to charge them more. If you do it professionally, you can charge them more. If you don't do it professionally, then you will have to, you know, have to bear charging very less. So in this course, I teach how to do it professionally. Okay, really professional level where you could actually charge a lakh rupees from any business. All right, and not even that, I'm also going to give you all the details that how you can make a website and even if you don't have any knowledge from scratch you'll be able to learn everything okay so that's one then after you know getting the money from the local market so what i did after getting the money from local market i've been doing consulting for a long time now almost three years i'm still doing it okay for a couple of websites i recently finished a project in mumbai i've recently got a project in us atlanta okay that's where i've got a project another project from right now uh, did another project in uh, Delhi, did another project in uh, in Gurgaon, did another project in uh, again Mumbai. So a couple of projects have been like all over the place doing a lot of projects. Okay. So now after I got the money from here, so what I did, I started enhancing my own brand. 
So now what I've done is I've enhanced my own brand and not just that, I also tried a couple of international courses, learned a lot of things from international courses, okay, and then I, I got into international market. So right now, uh, you know what we do, I'm just doing plain email marketing. So uh, guys, this is a top secret, me and Saurabh are doing plain email marketing and we make close to $5,000, $5,000 uh, in, in one month, okay. So that's just like plain email marketing. We just send emails. Okay, we build our list. We send emails and in a in multiple niche. So Saurabh is also building his channel on Instagram. I'm also doing it on Instagram. It's weight loss channel and Saurabh is into minions. Okay, so uh, you know we have a couple of good strategies now. We're scaling it up to a level which which is like unimaginable. So we will in within some time. Okay, within some time we'll be able to scale it close to like, you know, approximately $50,000. So that's something which we are targeting to begin with. All right, that's that's doable, that's easy. So, but, but the point is, what we did, we got the initial capital to invest somewhere. So the point is, at a very low cost, we got the initial capital from local market by delivering, you know, very little service and getting the initial capital and then going up, all right? So that's that's pretty stuff, pretty cool stuff, okay? So when you talk about the initial capital, uh, that's what you need to have. If you already have the initial capital, then you could go ahead and start doing it. But if you don't have the initial capital, my suggestion is go to the local market. A lot of people don't have the knowledge. They have good businesses. They have the potential to scale it up. They have the potential to get more business out of the you know online space. And you just need to place them on internet. Do some basic SEO, basic you know sales funnel, which we teach in the course. Okay. And then you are all set for your first investment and for the first money from internet. So let me tell you, we are promising that you know you could do one lakh rupees from that course. But trust me, the potential is you could actually turn out uh, to do fifteen lakh rupees per month as well. Okay, that's close to one lakh fifty thousand dollars. So not one lakh, sorry, uh, ten, so fifteen thousand dollars. So that's close to fifteen thousand dollars. So you could do that as well. That's pretty interesting stuff. Okay, so that was my first take. Then after that, what happened? Uh, I moved to the next zone, and what I did, I, I joined in DSIM, Delhi School of Internet Marketing, as digital marketing trainer. Okay, now that has given me some extra amount of leverage because a lot of people come uh, in DSIM who are very high profile to learn digital marketing, and I'm getting a lot of leads through that. Not just that, I've built my brand uh, brand channels like I have Gaurav Okay, so right now uh, I'm ranking for a couple of things. Okay, so right now I, I, I have a couple of things there. So, uh, you know, which which is getting me more leads. So someone is saying, so we are your competition. So why are you going to teach us those tricks? So the reason is because I am somebody like, you know, I cannot cover the entire world. I just cannot cover the entire world. And my strategy is I don't do uh, too many consulting tasks at one go. Because I am involved in a lot of things. So my strategy is to give you this power, okay, so that you go you can go ahead and execute it, execute it in all places, okay, in offline world. So I cannot possibly travel to US, UK, Canada, uh, Germany, okay, then uh, Israel or any such place. So if you are anywhere in the entire world, you could execute the same strategy, okay, and you could you leverage that. So that's why I'm doing it. One. Second thing. I'm going to earn money through this course, obviously. So that's why that's another reason. So making products is extremely good. And this is one of the products which I'm doing. Okay. So this is this product is also going to make me money, more money. And if it if, if I have more money, then I could invest more and I could actually experiment more and I could go ahead and do stuff. Okay, so there are no competitors, only collaborators. Absolutely, they're only collaborators. I'm even going to have a Facebook mastermind. Group. I'm even going to have a Facebook mastermind group where everybody, I'm going to guide everybody, me and Saurabh are going to guide everybody to do go through it. Okay, so that's not about it. So this is about my initial journey. So guys, uh, you know, uh, come on, tell me, did you find value out of this? You know, just type in value. Type in value in, in the chat box if you, if you think the strategy would work good. I'm going to give you more nuggets, how we are moving forward, what are our future plans and how we are actually going to move ahead. All right, value, value, value. Pretty cool. That's exciting. Okay, amazing stuff. So now, uh, thank you so much for all that. 
So, so guys, now once I've done this, now what was the next part which we did? So, next part is going to be extremely amazing. Okay, so now next part was I started investing in tools. I start, I got into international market and I started investing in tools to learn. Okay, how these tools work or what is what is the formula behind you know making of this entire tools and stuff. Okay, so now you know it's it is it's pretty easy. What you have to do is you. The, the thing is, if you have the money, you could outsource it. Okay, if you have the money, you could outsource it. The trap is not to do everything yourself. Now, local consulting, you can do everything yourself. Okay, but when you go into making of products or any kind of product like this, for example, this is uh, we did approximately close to 35 videos. Okay, in the course, some are one hour long, some are five minutes long. It is varying according to the topic. But we did not edit it ourselves. We did not videograph it ourselves. We got a person. So I have got another of my student, which is his name is Dave. So we got him to do all the video editing and all the video recording for us. So the key is not to fall into trap. Okay, not to fall into trap of doing it everything yourself. So outsourcing is something which saves you a lot of time and gives you leverage where other people work for you. Okay, right now I'm trying to outsource more things to all my of all of my students. I'm trying to do that, but I'm not able to do it because of certain obligations of my time right now. But I'm going to definitely outsource a lot of things to them so that they learn from their live experiences, and at the same time, I execute the other parts. Okay, so now a lot of people I saw, I I did a survey to ask, hey, what do you want me to talk about? A lot of people actually said to me that please talk about affiliate marketing. So next thing which I'm going to talk about now is affiliate marketing. Okay, so I I have been doing affiliate marketing for the past three months properly. Okay, uh, properly trust me, I am doing affiliate marketing from the past three months. So I use only two strategies, only two strategies, nothing else, plain two strategies. Okay, I'm going to be very absolutely you know honest about this and absolutely clear about it. Okay, so I'm not going to you know lie to anybody. So it's like an honest stuff which where I'm telling you about all my journey. So what I do, it's a very simple thing. First thing is to build a list. Okay, from the time I have realized that the money is in the list, you know, not it's just not, not about the money is in the list. All other sources, they actually somehow say that you cannot promote this, you cannot promote that, this, that, this, that. Okay, so there are restrictions on every platform. So what I did, I built a email list. Okay, now I have close to right now thirteen thousand. 500 email list. That's that's the size of my email list right now. 13,500. Okay, now that's pretty crazy. Now I've built it with real, real hard work. Okay, and I've built it on of different niche. I don't have just one niche for internet marketing. I have approximately uh, 3,000 list people of 3,000. Then I have 5,000 in another in another niche. Okay, I'm not going to reveal that right now because we're still working on that. And 5,000 in another. So I have five, five, and three. So we have like approximately thirteen thousand. I have, and Saurabh on the other hand has a database of thirty thousand people. Okay, so Saurabh does his like offline events, so he has his own database, which is pretty crazy. Okay, so once we have the database, what I do now, I find out relevant offers from, you know, like platforms like Click Clickbank, like platforms like JVZoo. Okay, these are affiliate networks in India. If you are, then you could find products from V Commission. Okay, V Commission. So I find out products which would fit, which would be a very good fit for my particular list, and it would add value to them. Okay, so I always believe in adding value. So if if that adds value, then only you know it is going to be a long term game. It's not going to be short term game. So what I do, I shoot an email to my list, talking to them about a particular product, telling them the benefits. I do, you know, sales uh, emails. I I do. I I write very good sales emails. So we have got like close to, you know, uh, one email thousand dollar conversions, one email fifteen hundred dollars conversions. Okay, so that's us what we have been having as as a track record right now, and we're just beginning. Okay, so as and when we grow in size of our list, we will be able to do uh, approximately ten thousand dollars one e- in one single email. Okay, so that's easily doable. So now what we do. Once one thing is, we actually go ahead and we use and we do email marketing. Okay. And second thing, what we do uh, now, uh, I have a pretty cool software which I use. I'm not going to tell you right now. 
Okay, what it does is if a particular person has clicked on a link in your email, then you could actually map that person to Facebook back, map that person to Facebook back, okay, and then you could retarget it. You could retarget it at in, in a at a very low cost, which is pennies. Alright? So that's what I've been doing. I have been able to exactly retarget people on the basis of if somebody clicks onto that particular link. Okay, then he's being retargeted in Facebook. Irrespective of the fact I don't own any kind of page, I'm directly sending him to an affiliate offer. Okay, so it's just completely based on email. So basically what I'm trying to do is I'm combining email and I'm combining Facebook. Okay, so Saurabh recently did an interview as well with Katie Lendl. Okay, so Katie Lendl is, people who know Katie Lendl, uh, she is an internet entrepreneur. So she's building a new Facebook ma ma mastery course. So Saurabh was able to get in there and you know Katie took her interview because as a newbie, so Saurabh is kind of a newbie, okay? So Saurabh learned uh, fa Facebook marketing actually like at a scale recently, okay? So it's, it's just three months Saurabh learned Facebook marketing properly. He does all other forms of marketing, but Facebook marketing is something which he learned recently. And what happened, okay? So he did so good with results because of the same strategy which we followed, that he ended up giving up an interview in an expert marketing course from Katie Lendl, all right, and he got featured. Now, that was really crazy, and then he also got featured in, in a local newspaper in India, all right, so that's like the PR strategies we do once he got the interview done. So, what he did, he, he actually mailed 195 people a story, 195 journalists were there, okay, he mailed the story and he got it covered in a local newspaper. So that's like the mind. You, you get something, you scale it up, okay? And you bring more equity to you. So that's, that has been the journey so far. Other than that, uh, other than that so I, I am into training people. So I love training people. So uh, that's something, you know, I'm going to launch my own courses, uh, not just a course. I'm going to come up with my own products as well in future, okay? Internet marketing uh, softwares or, or IT softwares, or some form of software which help people to achieve more. Okay, so that's something I'm going to get into and the key would be to outsource things. The key would be to outsource things. So that has been my path so far. Okay, first go on and do local. Go on and do local. Get the money in so that you are not burdened for a loan or, or you know something else to be taken from somebody else. Okay, you do it yourself. Get the money. Get the money flowing. Once you have the money flowing, start building your email list. Start building your email list in different segments. Now, I have taught a lot of ways through which you could build an email list. Okay, in one of my previous scopes, I discussed about uh, one simple thing, which is building a membership website with a very simple strategy. So, guys, uh, you, if, you, if you, some of you have missed that scope, it's in gauravmadan.com slash tv. Okay, it's gauravmadan.com slash TV. So I told people how they can build a community from scratch, okay? So email list is not just the key in the beginning, it's going to be the key forever, okay? It's going to be the key forever because email is compounded effort. It's a compounded effort. So what happens, It, you know, this email list is going to give you benefits long way, long way, repeated benefits, okay? All other things are just one time only. Okay, your Facebook fans, organic reach decrease, done, gone, all right? Then you talk about Twitter, organic reach, down, done, busted, okay? Then you talk about Instagram, I have even started seeing Instagram reach is getting down a little bit, okay? It has already started. But something which never goes away is your email list because the person will keep on using his email, right? So that's something is not going to go away with, okay? So that's, that's why, uh, you know, email list is so important because it is forever with you. And then you could build custom audiences in Facebook and in Twitter to remarket to these people further, okay? So right now I'm testing a lot of things, obviously, but my strategy is very simple. Build email list in different niche and then promote products. Either it's, it could be your products or it could be, uh, you know, somebody else's products. So, you know, either way, if you are giving... You know, and you know how you need to build your email list. So I don't approach an email, building an email list from other perspective like people do it. I do it from a very different scale. 
so i look ahead to marketing perspectives or different marketing angles okay so this was what i explained recently as well so what is this marketing angle so marketing angles is something when if you say if your target audience is like you want to sell imitation jewelry you you want to sell your imitation jewelry you've got a shop of imitation jewelry so what i do i map that map the audience i say hey my audience is preferably girls okay in the age of this and then i try to find out what other interests they may be having what other interests they may be having so what i do then after what finding out their interest i build something which is very valuable to them very valuable to them like for example girls love fashion girls love cooking okay girls love uh, you know a lot of tips that you could give to girls in terms of weight loss so there there are different ways you could now build an email list by providing them a digital product okay or maybe a membership website so what i do i go ahead and make this kind of a website all right and after making this kind of a website now i populate my advertisements everywhere so i you know i'll tell you what kind of advertisements i've been using i've been using google adwords i've been using google display network i've been using facebook advertisement i've been using twitter advertisement i've been using instagram okay i've been using organic linkedin linkedin groups basically i've been using pop up advertising i've been using solo ads okay so now i've been using in text contextual advertisement so there are nine forms of advertisement which i have been using to funnel in all the traffic to these websites okay when you funnel in all the traffic to these websites you start converting good all right and when you start converting good that's where your email list start building up really nicely i have tried contest as well i have tried a lot of stuff and everything works really well so when you have an aggregated email list now what you do is you introduce a, a secondary brand okay you introduce secondary brand or parent brand or sister brand when you introduce sister brand so what is going to happen is ultimately the sister brand you say hey this is another brand of this particular thing like this particular brand okay your sister or parent concern and we are into imitation jewelry and now i will we believe that you would be interested in it. and for a very exclusive time we are providing a discount we are providing a discount of 10% to all the existing customers or existing members of this membership website okay we email them and you would not believe that the results are amazing the results are tremendous since they know us since they trust us okay that is why they are able to you know cross buy from us so that's one of the extremely good strategies which i always uh, recommend like you know think from different marketing angles so what you have to do is think from different marketing angles and not just be you know accustomed to doing seo and just you know help down seo and you don't do anything so what you need to do again i'm going to brief this up go ahead get out in the local market if you don't know wait for the course this is coming very very soon it would be like very very soon okay so uh, uh, approximately within this september i plan to launch this some very late september okay build a, i mean build your business through local uh, local website building and local consulting even if you know just how to do facebook advertisements okay any skills that you may have we are talking teaching about consulting as well and building websites as well professionally okay so even if you have like a skill set where you just know about doing how to do facebook advertisements you could go out in local market target a lot of restaurants and then try to increase their footfall just by doing plain facebook advertising okay and if you are handling say 10 restaurants at one time i believe you would be able to make 10 lakh rupees in one month okay that's the bare minimum you would be able to make in one month all right so now once you have done that uh, next thing strategy is to start building your email list from from whichever country you want whichever uh, industry you want whichever niche you want okay start building your email list once you start building your email list things start you know churning up great things starts churning up to that particular level where you have the leverage of marketing remarketing the things again and again all right so that's that's interesting part and that's how you build a business online and once you have more money once you have more money you start making more products and you start diversifying you start diversifying okay and when you diversify you know what are going to be the benefits diversification leads to more income and more revenue and ultimately you know you will lead a happy life
Okay. So also remember one thing. Uh, you know, I'll give you one more nugget to achieve this. How I achieve this? Like, if you are doing a nine to six job, okay, how do you do that? So you'll say, hey, I'm doing a nine to six job, but uh, I possibly cannot do this. I'll say it's extremely easy. Okay. So if you're doing a job, you travel during job timings, right? You not just not travel. You have free timings. So what you need to do is you need to divide your time into productive productive amount of time and non productive amount of time or you could say income generating activities non income generating activities and then start prioritizing your income generating activities for for the next 21 days okay if you start prioritizing your income generating activities for the next 21 days and your non income activity uh, non income generating activities if you keep it aside and you know do it only at a time when your mind is not working Your mind is completely exhausted. At that point in time, you could do those non-productive activities. Okay, non-productive activities. Now, if you do that, now what is going to happen? It's very simple. It's very simple. Now you are going to use. You are going to be more productive. Okay, and at the same time, you will hack out a couple of two hours to three hours every day, every day, which was going into non-productive activities. You hack that time out, and you would still be able to consult in local market. Okay. So I've taught like you know the, the course contains everything how to generate leads, how to close them, how to build a relationship with your clients, how to get more uh, you know uh, uh, more recommendations for them, how to get more clients and stuff like that. So that's going to have help you in absolutely everything. Okay. So uh, but the strategy is going local first and leveraging what you already have and not fall into the trap of you know those big making money online things where you have to invest a lot of money. because once you start investing and if you're not making out like a like getting returns you get dejected you get really really disheartened and once you start doing that that's like going to be crazy stuff uh, you know if you're not having money you would really really land in somewhere where you'll be like you know heads down and you'll be like you know why why I'm doing this even for that matter okay so that's that's the entire strategy that's how I've been able to do it okay and I'm really making it big and not just this Once I've done this, all these consulting assignments. Now I'm going to do panel discussions and workshops for all the business owners in Mumbai, starting with Mumbai, then Bangalore, then Delhi. Okay, I'm going to move this, and I'm going to convert it into workshop, panel discussions, and these events are going to be paid events. Okay, and I know for a matter of fact, when I have a lot of client base, I have a following, I could easily do this. Okay, I could easily do this. So, Sandy, does it also help in creating templates? Uh, templates, yes, it does help in creating templates. Uh, okay, but it's not drag and drop. You'll have to HTML code that. You'll have to HTML code that, Raghav. Okay, so you know, Raghav, again, the key is to outsource. The key is to outsource. Get a coder, give him five thousand rupees, get him to make fifty templates for you, HTML templates, and reuse them again and again. Okay, so that's pretty simple, pretty plain. So that's that's what I would suggest. The key is to outsource. Okay, so you really have immense knowledge about digital world. Yes, I do have. You know, uh, trust me, it's it's taken a lot of time. Uh, approximately sixteen, uh, sorry, five years of my time has gone into this, and and you know, I I don't uh, have a problem sharing that knowledge. So, for example, uh, one of the problems with people is people cannot track properly. People are still using Google Analytics to track. So I'm going to do a free workshop, okay, free webinar of approximately like you know it would go the webinar would go approximately like the entire day long. So it would be like eight to nine hours long webinar, eight to nine hours long webinar. Okay, you cannot imagine that, right? So eight to nine hours webinar, long webinar where I'm going to talk from scratch to execution it for to perfection. And how you could actually track and optimize each and every campaign you do without the need of Google Analytics. Okay, without the need of Google Analytics. Now that's going to be coming. That's going to be coming soon. But that would be like tremendous amount of value. Nine hours long webinar on tracking. Can you actually believe that? I'm going to do that. Okay, nine hours long webinar. It's going to be a Monday. So make sure you you are going to take a holiday on a Monday. Okay, sometime soon. I'm going to mail you about it. So if you're not in my email list, get into my email list, garumadan.com/tv. I'm going to do a nine-hour-long webinar, which nobody has done. Obviously, we'll be having lunch breaks and we'll be having breakfast breaks of half an hour. Okay. That's having said that. 
So you could do that as well. And then we are going to take it like in one day, we are going to really nail the exact thing, okay? Because I don't want any of you to suffer just like me, all right? I don't want any of you to suffer just like me uh, because I invested a lot of money and time in this and I want to help you guys to reach your objective so that it gives me more leverage for, you know, so that uh, I, I know more people, you tell me to uh, you tell uh, about internet profits to other people and stuff like that, okay? And I'm going to give, do an early bird list as well for this, okay? So I'm going to do an early bird list for this as well. So this, so the early early bird list is going to be like you know you're going to get this as at a at a flat price at a lesser price and not just that the people who are going to be in early bird list I'm going to give you a chance to actually sell this course not just do it take it I'm going to give you a chance to sell this course so uh, I'm going to plan I'm planning it to launch at five thousand rupees I'm going to let you sell this to all your people like whosoever you know. From your unique link, and I'm going to give you 50% commissions. Okay, so if the course is at 5,000 rupees, and if you bought it at 5,000, now you could actually go ahead and enroll two more people, and you could just make your investment back altogether. Okay, so just two more people, and your investment is completely back. Right. So I'm going to do that, and and not just that, I'm going to give you instant commissions. Okay, a lot of affiliate networks, what they do is they give you commissions pretty late. Like, you know, they will give you after one one month. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to transfer it the very next day. Okay, so if you're going to sell this course today, tomorrow you're going to have it in your bank account. The money is going to be in your bank account tomorrow. All right, so that's what I'm planning right now. So that's 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 the level I want you uh, to do, to the level I want you to, I want to help you. So make sure you grab onto that early bird list. Okay, only early bird list in the initial phase are going to get this opportunity. Uh, I'm not going to do, uh, you know, uh, JVZoo or, or something like that. I'm going to do a direct bank transfer. Okay, I'm going to do a direct bank transfer or if you have PayPal, I'll be doing a PayPal with you. Okay, so uh, that's what I'm going to do. So, uh, and it's like flat commissions, 2,500, which is extremely amazing. You just sell it to 10, 10 people, you start making money, 25,000 bucks right there. Okay, and the course is so powerful, you could easily get anybody in because anybody can make money from this formula. And, you know, literally it would help a lot of, of your friends as well. Okay. So that's another thing which I wanted to tell you. Uh, okay. So guys, now it's the time of you. Now, I, I've been talking a lot, right? Uh, it's your time to talk back and, you know, tell me uh, about your, your your experiences. If you want to have, ask any questions, uh, I'm open to it. Again, I hope you enjoyed the training. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the training. So, I mean, it was just like me sharing my experience so far. So you could ask me questions. Uh, this is like affiliate marketing. Yeah, it's going to be kind of like affiliate marketing, but uh, I'm not going to use any platform. I'm going to use my own custom software to do this. Okay, that's the best part. I'm going to use my own custom software. So you could also be uh, uh, get sales page and a video in order to assist in selling it. Yep, definitely. So a solo ad. Somebody is asking me what is solo ads. Now solo ads is a very unique concept. Okay, so what is solo uh, ads? Solo ads is a way to actually, like, you know, a lot of people on the internet have huge list, have huge list, like 10,000 people email list, okay? But they don't know how to make money from it. So what they do is they, they, they send traffic to everybody who wants, uh, you know, traffic on their web page. So they have list in their, in, in their existing, like any particular niche you want, like a dog niche, like a, a dating niche, like a, maybe a training niche, like a survival niche, like a motivation niche. So any niche you want, you'll get a list there, okay? And what you could possibly do, possibly do is, then you could actually go ahead and give them money, and their exact targeted list, they're going to send it to your landing page. So I make a landing page, I make a giveaway, and then I get them to my list, okay? Get them to my page, I pay money, so you, you spend close to $1 uh, in one click, but that's going to be extremely good, because, you know, I have a list of 3,000 people, I end up making $5,000 in one month, okay, and that too, not promoting a lot of stuff, okay? So, will your course be useful to people who are non-digital marketers? Absolutely, the course is going to be useful for each and everybody. We are even planning to go school-wide and like, like college-wide and give, start giving presentations, okay? You could also do that. I'll provide you with the presentations. You could go to colleges, give presentations, okay, and then ask people to buy it from your link. And you would be making a lot of money. I'm going to do that, definitely. And, you know, that's one. 
and it's it's like for anybody who who does not do anything okay now somebody says will you be teaching clocking no clocking uh, is not that part so clocking is something really really uh, advanced metric okay so clocking would be a part of perhaps uh, you know i don't do cloaking i don't actually do cloaking because that that gets our account suspended okay can you provide few proposal templates i'm going to have all the proposal templates and you know emails and everything right there okay i'm going to prepare all the material and give it to you so don't worry so it is going to come and for consulting i've already got couple of templates and you know and i've put that in my course so you have proposal templates in consulting as well like you know the course so can you code uh, i don't know how to code I don't know how to code, but I still can. You know, uh, now th the point here is, okay, it doesn't matter if you can code or not. I have people who can code for me. I will give five thousand rupees to a person, and they will they will go ahead. All right, so they'll go ahead and uh, do it for me. That's not a big deal. So coding is not not you know. So something which I specialize is in marketing. Okay, my core is marketing. I don't code, and I don't even like coding. So I could do a little bit of HTML. I could do JavaScript. Okay, full HTML. Uh, uh, 90% JavaScript I could do. 70% uh, CSS I could do. All right, but I still don't do it. I still don't do it. Okay, because that's not my job to do it. I I, I like marketing more, and that's what I. Do. So I I I tend to outsource these things. Okay, that it saves time and increases productivity. The key is to outsource. You could go to Fiverr.com and do it only for five dollars. Can you guide who can teach cloaking? Uh, so who's this guy who's looking to get cloaking? So this is uh, Vishal Tudi. All right. So cloaking uh, is a very advanced stuff. You could use tools for that. Okay. There are a lot of uh, tools like WP Clock is one tool through which you could do cloaking. For people who don't know what cloaking is, let me explain. So cloaking is a method where you actually show, you know, make make uh, the visitor see something different. Make the visitor see something different. Okay. And uh, you know, and make him like once he visit the visit the page, then you actually you know change the complete page and redirect the page to something completely different. Okay, WP Cloak uh, Cloak is a software WP Cloak, and uh, so what you could do is this guy whosoever is asking, I'm so sorry. So what you could do is you could go to Funnel Flux. There is something called as Funnel Flux. That's an advanced software which you could use possibly to cloak as well. Okay. How about fraud buster client? I'm not sure about that. So trust me, uh, I don't do cloaking. Okay, uh, I don't really want to go into cloaking because that makes our ads like that gets our ads uh, account suspended. So cloaking is something I don't recommend. Okay, I don't recommend. So this must be somebody who is into uh, you know uh, that particular thing which is called uh, call call funnel flux. It's funnel flux. It's not final flux. It's funnel flux. Can you say example of cloaking? Forget about cloaking, guys. Cloaking is something which I I do not recommend. I do not promote cloaking. Okay, so because it gets your ad account suspended and it it gives us bad name. So I don't recommend cloaking. Please don't do it. Okay, and and the person who's asking it, I'm pretty sure he is into uh, he's into something called as uh, what do you say? Uh, this is like call centers. So like you you generate calls for call center. So a lot of those guys actually do uh, you know cloaking. Okay, so so. I, I don't recommend that. Okay, any more questions you have for me? And guys, uh, press press. You know, uh, so give me some hearts if you like today's to training. So forget about cloaking. Cloaking is a you know altogether a bad thing. So uh, if you like the training, give me some hearts. So you have to tap on the screen so that I could know. Hey, I could see different colors hearts. If you understood, like how brilliantly you could do that. Okay, so how brilliantly you could do that. Okay, great. That's pretty cool. All right, so I'm extremely happy that you you really like the training. Okay, so time for another song. What's it? Shall we do another song right now? Uh, let's just do and another song, and we shall really exit it from the training there. All right, uh, time for another song. I'll push this a little bit closer. Let's see. I don't break this. So you'll have to guess this one as well, guys.
पास महनीला क्यों पान गीला गीला क्यों गोल क्यों है सबे I got to another one for you quick another one so this is a pretty cool uh, okay so this one is like one of my favorites on guitar from rock on absolutely